Yeah, I mean, obviously you guys had it going on in the uh, early in the game. You get in a little bit of foul trouble. How did you uh, did you feel like that was a, a factor in them kind of turning the t- turn of the tide? I mean, yeah, of course. I mean, it's hard when I'm not out there. Um, in the sense that I think I bring up, I'm able to t- communicate with my team. Obviously, I'm the cover back person on defense, um, and I feel like I let my team down in that way, um, which is frustrating. Um, but I also believe in the girls that we have, um, and they continue to fight and play hard. Um, it was just unfortunate situation. For you guys on defense, were they doing anything that was kind of giving you guys trouble or were they were just, you know, making their shots? Yeah, um, they did, they, they made a lot of shots. Uh, um, and we, we tried to adjust. It just, it just, I don't know, one of those games. In that first quarter, you guys were just mm-hmm. lighting up from everywhere. It seemed like you guys were able to click. And I know that unfortunately the result wasn't exactly what y'all wanted. Mm-hmm. But through this game, knowing that you guys have that capability to play at that level, does that help fuel you guys into the next opportunity? Yeah, I mean, everybody's um, was down, but like, I'm just, for me, it's just like, I know how good we are. Um, and I saw how good we can be, like how good some of the girls were tonight. Um, and it just, losses like this suck, but they just motivate us to like, you know, go even harder the next game. and. Um, like coach said, like we don't look at the results or like outcomes or like future. He's like, we just move on to the next day. So um, I'm really proud of us and how we fought through adversity during during this game. Um, I think it honestly makes us better, um, which is a good thing. You guys have played a lot of close games throughout the year, especially you know, over the last few weeks or so. I mean, how, how, <coughs> how tired are, are you of just like these games that just go down in like the absolute last possession? Uh, yeah, I mean, they're rough and that just shows how tough the conference is. Um, and the fact that we're we're at the top of that conference um, means a lot about us. Um, um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So obviously, you guys are still in a spot where you can uh, you know come out of it in second place. What's uh, what's the mindset going to Fresno? Yeah, um, we I mean we don't really care about our placement right now. Like you said, we just focus on Fresno, and uh, we're gonna watch film tomorrow, go through things tomorrow, and that's all we can focus on is the next day and what we gotta accomplish. Um, and that's been keeping us steady this through this whole season, and that's what we're going to continue to do. Because of the fouls, you were out about half the game. Yeah. What do you say to the people that came in for you, especially the younger ones like Laura? Yeah, no, Laura's been great. Um, she's, I think, she was the one who was in for me. Um, and just keeping her confidence up. Um, obviously, she's a great defender, um, and making sure that. She knows what she's doing, and it's really about giving her confidence and everybody else confidence because we all can play. It's just showing up, and I think she did a good job.